Jingle bell, jingle bell, jingle bell, geode. Hey Goldie Squad, it's Goldie Blocks, and today's video is all about gift hacks. Hack along this holiday season with me. That's all I have to say. <laughs> Texting gloves, texting gloves, texting gloves, texting gloves. That's a way to present this gift to people. Just be like, guess what I got you? Texting gloves, texting gloves. It's like a Vogue remix. They're kind of self-explanatory. These are gloves that you can actually text with. The way these work is basically you put some puff paint on them and then you get this special like metal thread that you sew through the puff paint. So when your finger touches the wire and the wire touches the phone, it creates a circuit so it actually works. It's really cool, right? Science! This is a gift that's just foolproof. You just give her these texting gloves and then she'll like be able to text you, thank you, <laughs> with her warm fingers. For this DIY, you'll need a pair of gloves, puff paint, and metallic thread. First, apply puff paint to the fingertips of the gloves. I made mine into little hearts. You can do whatever you want. Let it dry overnight. Sew a little bit of metallic thread to the tips of each finger. This will put a conductive thread between the screen and our finger. These step up your texting game so much you can like text without even looking at it. I am going to hack something today. Do you want to come? Because hacking is great with Goldie. That definitely says what I wanted it to say. It's not random letters. <laughs> we have homemade geode rocks. And if you don't know what a geode rock is, it's like a crystal that's inside like a rock because it's been pressed down for so many years like in the earth. So it crystallizes, then when you cut it open, it's a beautiful geode. And they take millions or billions of years to form. And you know, I don't have time for that. What do you do? You hack your own glue salt one. They're so pretty. It doesn't really matter if you have the most ultimate rock shaping skills. You don't really need it. You just make it a little ball. Maybe tear some pieces off. That's what makes them beautiful because they're imperfectly perfect. Geode rocks. They're rocks that are pretty. For this DIY, you'll need rock salt, Elmer's glue, food coloring, glitter, tin foil, and gold spray paint. First, mix the glue and the food coloring. Pour in about half as much sea salt, enough so you're able to bunch it with your hands, but still goopy. The glue dries super fast when you add salt, so mix it quickly. Grab a handful and shape it to look like a rock. The more uneven and random, the better. While the geodes are still wet, glitter the tops of them so they look like the real thing. dry overnight. Now spray paint the bottom for a finishing touch. There's a really deep meaning behind these geodes. You might say, Goldie, it's a fake rock. Just leave it. But no, no, no. Let's say that like humanity is like Play-Doh. It rolls down the stairs. When it gets to the bottom of the stairs, it's a human. And when you get off the stairs, you have little bumps and bruises, a little imperfect, you know, because humans are definitely not perfect. If there was a perfect human, it would be Beyonce, but we're not getting to that right now. There's little hairs on it. That's what makes this mess right here. Look at this, a little piece fell off. Just like losing a baby tooth when you're a child. That's probably a way deeper meaning than you ever asked for, for a geode rock or for humanity. But at Goldie Plox's channel, we go deep into hacks. Are you guys liking more Zen Goldie? Yin and Yang. I've been taking yoga classes, can you tell? And for our last hack, we have this guy. 
you know, when it's dark and you're like, this lighting is not flattering, man. I wanna take a good selfie for the Insta. Maybe that's just me. And then I'm gonna take a normal picture without the light. Oh, that was bad. Okay. And then I'm gonna turn it on. That is very bright. Let's try that with the lights off. Yeah, you look back at the photos and ew, these, all these photos look terrible. I think I wanna delete all of these. But that didn't work as I expected because <laughs> the lights kind of face that way and not towards you. Maybe this is more of like a flashlight in the dark when your phone dies. You just stick it into a belt and then when your phone dies, you're just like, pop it on, I'm lost. And you can go like that, so. For this DIY, you'll need a phone case, hot glue, and a string of LED lights. First, put batteries in your LED lights and make sure they work. Next, take your phone case and line up the LED lights. Now, glue the battery pack to the back of the phone case. Peel off the backing of the LED strip and carefully line the sides of the case all the way around. Careful not to cover the USB or the headphone jack. Insert your phone and turn on the light. You know what? We're just gonna use it as like a DIY disco ball. Wow, this turntable is lit! Whoa! Turn up, am I right? Okay, this is just... This is just sad. Okay. Move. Well, that's it for today. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. And tell me in the comments your favorite because mine was the geodes, obviously. And make sure to give it a big thumbs up if you liked it. And subscribe for more DIYs every Friday. That's all I have for you guys today. Geode, would you like to say anything? No? Geode and geoldy blocks. Sign off. And make sure you have a hacky holidays. Oh, I love that so much. Geos are really fun to hack. Jingle bell, jingle bell, jingle bell phone case. Da 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 da. And texting gloves are awesome too.